So it is now Saturday. Uh, it is about almost 1.30 in the afternoon. Pretty much just woke up and ate some breakfast and later ate some lunch. Just chilled out for a while. And then now we're going to, Keegan and I, what up? are going to head over to where our mom works, which is like down the road at the uh, Sunspot Observatory uh, Visitors Center. Go see her there and uh, probably just hang out there. I haven't been there before, so it'll be the first time. Um, yeah, today's going to be really just chill, pretty much, because there's really nothing to do today. It's party, birthday party's tomorrow, but, you know, we're just going to chill out, relax, be nice now that we're up here in the mountains, so probably just talk to you later. All right, so Keegan has a, a shirt. We want to. We already tested it out, but kind of want to show on camera. I want to watch it change. It changes color with the sun, you know, because it's a sunspot. So they have shirts like that. So uh, it's. I mean, it's it's under this. So here we'll go over here. And let's see. Ready? Should change colors. Do it fast. We should be able to watch it get darker. It's pretty sick. I don't know if you're able to see it on camera. But it got a lot darker. This should change colors too down here. So yeah. And then this came green. So that's pretty sick. I don't know if you can see it. If you can't, we'll just cut it out. But it's pretty cool. I don't know if you can see me. I'm by the sun, so I'm probably a silhouette. Oh yeah. And you like my hat? We figure since we haven't seen snow since uh, the snow days, and uh, probably never will again. Probably won't ever again. We figured we'd just go, you know, touch some snow. And really, it's just ice. You want to make a, want to make a, a yellow snow cone? So this is the main telescope at <clears throat> Sunspot the National Solar Observatory. It's the coolest looking one at that. So we're gonna go up this way, uh, this way up that little trail. I was pointing too high right there. And there should be a lookout, but what, I'm, what I've heard that you can't see anything because there's too many trees, so we're just gonna see. So I'll just see you up there. So I know I said I'd meet you up on that trail, but uh, I actually found something really cool first. So I'm going to show you this really quick, this awesome view. It's pretty amazing. You look over here, 
that little white speck right there, that is Apache Point Observatory. That is where Bill works. I work there too. This guy has worked there doing hard labor. So, I don't know if you can hear me. It's pretty windy. It's really cold. And, uh, that's it for that. Now we're going to go up that trail. Alright, so that's what we just climbed up. Now here we are. A treacherous walk. And uh, that's the view. Not very good because of the trees. You can see pretty far though. As you can see, there's the telescope again. So yeah. And here's me. Here's so Kevin. yeah. Here, let's see if we can see anything. Oh, I didn't put a carter in. <laughs> <laughs> you need a carter? <laughs> It is now almost 11 o'clock. Uh, it's a pretty cool day. Pretty chill day, really. Like I said earlier, it's just nice to be home, really, to be able to just chill out and relax. Um, you know, just went over and hung out at the visitor center and then came back and uh, played some pool. Uh... And just pretty much hung out, ate dinner with the family and everything, and then the only reason, uh, well, I'm like really tired right now, uh, the only reason I'm not asleep is because uh, the Aggies, the New Mexico State Aggies, are playing a basketball game. Uh, they're in Hawaii right now, that's why it's so late that they're playing. Um, it's halftime, it's not really going as well as we had hoped, but they're coming back, so it's only a three-point game right now, anything can happen in the next half, we'll see, I'm um, probably not going to record any more tonight, probably just going to go to bed after the game, so I'll probably just tell you who won tomorrow, and yeah, what did you think about today, Keegan? Pretty good day overall, <clears throat> got a little haircut, a little snip snip, a little, little, little snip snip, a little snip snip, um, Hope the Aggies pull this one out, you know, uh, get, steal a win in Hawaii. Hard to win in Hawaii. But, um, yeah, that was a good day. Uh, got a little haircut. Got a little Aggie game going on. Chilling out. That's pretty much it. Just chilling out. That's what this weekend was for, sort of. I got one last thing. And then Maggie's birthday, which is tomorrow. Well, her birthday party. Really? <laughs> And that's that's how we're just pretty much going to end the day. <laughs> that's how about how it's going to have to that's end. That's about now. how it's going to have to end. So, <laughs> till tomorrow. Well, <laughs> see you tomorrow. It is Sunday now. Um... I'm in the place that Maggie's birthday is. Uh, it's actually already 2 o'clock, so the party has officially started. Uh, I hadn't recorded anything because we just, you know, got ready for the party and had lunch and stuff. But, uh, so yeah. Um, pretty much just gonna, you know, do the party thing and then we're gonna pretty much head out, head back to Crucis. And it's snowing, if you couldn't tell by what's behind me and what you saw just a second ago. Uh, so yeah, it's cool. At the same time, it kind of sucks because I'm kind of nervous about driving down the mountain now. But it was snowing harder a little bit earlier. Probably snow harder a little bit later. Whatever. Um, so yeah, I'll talk to you guys later, I guess.
rough stuff, dude. So, we are driving down the mountain right now. So you can see there's a lot of snow. If you look forward, there's snow on the road. Forcing us to drive very slowly. Can already tell this isn't going to be a very fun drive. As you can tell by my enthusiasm. Um, oh, I just uh, realized that I forgot earlier to tell you who won the game last night, I think. Yeah, it wasn't a very good game. We uh, didn't play our best. and I know we can play a lot better than that. We have great players on our team. But we lost, and uh, that really sucks. But anyway, so we are heading down. We're going to stop and get gas either in Cloudcroft or Alamogordo. I haven't really figured that out yet. But So I'll see you then because I'll make sure to record there. But, uh, yeah, just real quick, just you can look at the snow. It's pretty cool, actually. I mean, it looks awesome. I just hate driving in it. But, yeah. So... It's cool that we got to see more snow, even though it's funny, earlier in the vlog, we were saying we wanted to touch that snow, because we probably wouldn't touch snow again, and then boom, snow. That's pretty much all I gotta say. If Keegan wants to say something, he can say something. Oh yeah, and I'm chilling, chilling, chilling. Yeah, I don't know. I got nothing. I'm just, uh... So got... anyway, that's about it. That's all we got. Meet me up at Harry's Bar. That's about it for now. So I'll see you at the gas station. And to uh, end this, uh, keep your eyes open. Just left the gas station, got some gas in Alamogordo. Decided to just go all the way down to Alamogordo first. So we're about to drive through Alamogordo and then head to Cruces. So it's going to be a crappy drive because I can already tell it's really windy. So it just sucks. And. I'll probably just end up seeing you in Cruces because I just want to get there already. So, I'll talk to you then. So, it's almost 11.30 at night now. That drive was absolutely sucky. It sucked the whole way here. It was windy and everything. Uh, got back, unloaded the car, went to... Um, Taco Bell to pick up some dinner, then went to uh, back here, and we watched the Oscars, or the rest of them, uh, then we went to Walmart with Lucas, then we <laughs> went uh, back, uh, back to Taco Bell for Lucas to get some dinner for himself, then now we're here. Uh, so yeah, I mean, it's been pretty much... The gist of the rest of my day, and uh, that's pretty much it. It's pretty, uh, pretty a long day. Uh, pretty fun. Had a good time at Maggie's party. I don't know if I said that. I mean, as much fun as you can have at a five-year-old's birthday party. And um, yeah, it's pretty much it for the day. Yeah. Yeah. Huh? Yeah. So, until next time, well, see you later.